All right, guys. So today, a brand new video on my channel. Today, guys, is going to be episode six. No, yeah, episode six. I think. So yeah, episode six of the uh, Warlock series here on PvP.com. If you want to check out the server, the IP is down below. Sorry for the delay of videos. I have been working so much with my IRO job. Sadly, you know how it is. You know, I got a promotion recently, and it's mean that I have to work more. But yeah, I'm back and we're recording more videos. Yeah, this video is going to be a bit different, but before we do get into the video, I do really want to open up these two divine books that I have been saving up. Uh, yeah, bro, I could have done more, but I keep getting killed at mine by like the PvP factions and it's making me want to cry. But um, yeah, I'm going to open up these. I managed to get two divine books, which isn't too great. I wanted to get like five or like ten, but yeah, we'll, we'll have to settle for two. Um, so yeah, hopefully we can get something good and I haven't been fishing that much either so I haven't been able to like, you know, get many masks or anything but I'm gonna do some fishing soon because I do actually have like a lot of fishing boosters. I've got like this one and I have like, um, uh, I have like four of these so yeah, I have a lot of fishing boosters which I might do for another video maybe like see how many masks I can get with like five fishing boosters which I might do on a stream, I don't know, we'll have to wait and see. If you want to see my streams, make sure you subscribe to the channel and leave a notification and leave a like on the video if you do enjoy. But anyway, let's see. Um, this this Mark Who guy is gonna give us good luck, so please give us good luck. Uh, Juggernaut two, yes, 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 yes. Juggernaut two. That's actually really, really good. Not great percentages. Um, we're gonna need we're gonna need uh, to re-roll that definitely. But I've only got two point eight k souls, which I think I definitely need a bit more. And I got. Omni Blade Five, uh, Omni Blade Three, which is 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 really really bad. How much will it cost for me to re-roll this? Um, I think I can probably re. Um, I can I can salvage that and get a decent amount of um, decent amount of XP back. So I got two thousand five hundred XP back. Um, where's the re? Um, where's the re-roll merchant? Isn't it around here somewhere? Uh, no. Um, no. Uh, hello. I think it might be this guy. No, it's this guy. This guy. This guy right here. So it costs 20,000 souls. Ooh, that is a lot of souls. I'm definitely going to have to go and grind a bunch of zombies or something and grind up a bunch of souls for that because that is a lot of souls. But luckily, I think I do have some soul boosters. Yeah, I do. I have I have one and I think I actually might have some more somewhere else in my base. Oh, I've actually got, yeah, I've got two here and another one here. So yeah, I should be able to get up to a decent amount pretty, pretty soon. Yeah, we'll put that in my PV for now. Um, we'll save that for another day because my 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 G set is getting a lot better. Once that jug is on my chest plate, I think it is a chest plate in China, isn't it? Yeah, it is a chest plate. All I really need is like one more chest in Chan, uh, one more boot in Chan, and one more leg in Chan. I think, and they're pretty easy ones to get as well. And I just need to upgrade my sword a little bit more, and that's pretty much it. But anyway, yes, um, let's get actually into the proper part of the video. This video is going to be a little bit different. It's not going to be like, you know, your usual, you know, fishing video or raid video or anything like that. Um, I wanted to do this video because people have been asking me, you know, can you make a can you make a how to make money video on Psycho, which honestly, I don't really need to do one. It's it's so simple. This video will literally be your guide. It's so simple, guys. Like, honestly, you don't need to waste your time with all these like big ass tutorials i'm gonna get straight to the point and just say fishing fishing is the best way only if though for a few things only if you have a like if you have a rank which allows you to do slash e chest or slash pb and you have a few slots um i'd say it's worth it but if you don't have it uh it, it's very risky but i mean you can still fish if you have no rank you can always just you know fish and just try and save up and just make sure you just don't die so honestly it, it's so much better than just making a melon farm if you make a melon farm you have to make a huge one and then you have to wait for it and then you have to do it like that if you fish you can literally just bro it, it's so much more fun as well like every single fish is like what 75 dollars each 200 dollars 500 dollars like and these little lower ed ones which you can just do slash sell all as a rank as well and then you know if you get these ones it's like 10k per which you know you can grind melon farms at all that time which is fun and all but guys if you get something good if you get like a possessed treasure or a basic treasure or a mystery mob mask those are worth so much more money and if you open up a mystery mob mask and you get like a horse mask or like an ig mask you can sell those for millions and millions and millions of dollars so you can literally and it's just it's much more fun it's much more enjoyable than just you know just running up and down a strip mining melons which i'm not even going to bother showing you how to make a melon farm if you don't know how to make a melon farm by now 
This is the worst tutorial ever. I'm really sorry, but I'm just not going to show you. Pretty simple, just place melons. You don't need water on Psycho either, so literally just make a massive dirt patch and just plant melons eat it. Yeah, but I wouldn't suggest to do that. I would suggest to do fishing or mining. Mining for impures is a really good way to get in divine books. If you can get divine books or just even impures and pure gems in general, you can sell them on AH for so much money. And it's just so much easier and it's so much more fun as well. Because opening up things is fun. Like opening things up like mystery mob masks and treasures and stuff like that is just it's more fun than just mining melon and selling it so you're having more fun doing it and you're actually making more money in the long term like bro i've had like i think i've had like over 10 mystery mob masks so far this map technically i could have got about 80 million already for those masks alone i'm just fishing ah, run away run away come back another day yeah what you want to do is literally just get yourself a fishing rod which is i think is like 250 dollars and then you want to get yourself an invis which is only like $300, so yeah, all together, only, what, 700 and, no, wait, no, $550, yes. <laughs> so $550, literally that is like, what, two fishes and you've already made your money? But yeah, guys, you can literally just go in Viz and go to like a secret spot up here. Uh, if you haven't seen my videos in the past, like with the cobweb thing, uh, especially when there's like barely any players on the server, like right now there's only 76 players. You can quite easily go to any of these cobweb spots, like you can go to this one or you can go to this one up here. And like look, there's 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 no one around, I don't think. I don't think there's anyone. I'm just fish up here and I'm just going to show you, I'm not going to like, I am going to just fish for like 8 minutes long or as long as my invis is on. And I'm gonna fish and I'm not gonna slash sell anything. I am gonna, you know, just keep fishing for seven minutes. I'm not gonna slash sell. I'm just gonna show you that you can do it even as a person with no rank. So you don't have to spend money on a rank to make money on the server. It's very, very easy. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna try and not slash sell all because I do slash sell all like kind of like, it's kind of like an autopilot thing. I just do it anyway. But um, yeah, I'm gonna try my best not to do it and I'll see you in a second guys. Right, so I have literally like two seconds left on my invis and I did not die once. So yeah, it just it just shows it can be done. I didn't get anything like really good. Um, I got really excited for a second because I thought that was a mob mask, but it was just a mystery mob. Uh, it was just a mask fragment, which are still pretty good. Like you can still put them towards like if you get enough of them, I think you can like craft them into something. Uh, is it this guy? Yeah, so you can like, you can, I could actually buy one right now. I could actually, yeah, wait, what? Yeah, I could actually get myself a mystery mob mask right now. Or you could save up and get like a divine one. You can get a special one for 160. I'm actually, you know, I'm actually like save up and try and get one of these divine ones. I'm not actually that far off. But yeah, you can spend on other things uh, like mask fragments. Like, so it's still pretty good. I think on the AH, um, if I go to these, just type in like mask fragment yeah so they're like bro like, yeah like 170k 200k each i don't know if that's actually the price that's just what they're up at the moment it could be cheaper or could be more i don't know but um yeah yeah just from that little fish alone so i spent 500 dollars uh, 550 dollars on a fishing rod and an invis pot i went into fish for eight minutes uh, i got a mask fragment which is pretty really good and then all you do is just sell these fishes and that's 450 dollars there another 450 dollars uh, 600 dollars there uh, 1,200, got some squids, got 2,500 there, and then 1,500, and can't sell that one. I uh, got three of those, that's 3.7k. Uh, I got a deluxe arcane, which is 25k, and then I got an enchanted salmon, which is 5k right there as well. So, yeah, we got like what? I think I got like 35k or something like that. Yeah, like over 35k, which is good. You know, it, it's profit. Yes, you could in that eight minutes, you could have mined a couple layers of melon and you could have got like a lot more money but it's just more of like the chance of actually getting a mystery mob mask is the thing like you could fish for like an hour and you could get a mystery mob mask in an hour it's easily done or you can get possessed treasure or you can get like a divine treasure you can get something like that and you'll literally make millions and millions and millions and if you mine melons for an hour you probably make a couple hundred k so um yeah it's it's just it, it's chance at the end of the day it's fun as well so uh yeah it, it's just good so long story short guys, instead of, you know, making a melon farm, spending loads of time building a melon farm and then spending loads of time mining a melon farm, just get a fishing rod, just go invis, or you don't even have to go invis, I could have just been easily invis, um, not invis there, or I could have just wore a set and I probably wouldn't have died anyway, so yeah, just, just fish, please. Right, so guys, next thing I want to show you as well is another way of making money, one of the best ways to make money, this is probably the best way to make money, honestly. 
it's by doing the fire glitch on skeletons which is so so good it makes so much money but the only thing yeah you have to worry about is getting up to level uh, i think you have to be yeah level like seven like right here you have to have actually have accomplished uh, level seven uh, level six i mean so you actually have to like unlock level six then be level seven to do this which you have to be able to kill skeletons the reason why it's so good is because you can do this fire glitch all you do is just get a fire aspect sword and you just put them on fire like that and you just hit them so once they've done a little bit of damage you hit them like that make them bounce and pretty much what it does it drops a bunch of skeleton heads so it just means that you don't have to hit them I mean, you could literally probably make more money as well from just sitting here and just grinding skeletons anyway without a fire aspect. Yeah, it's so good. You just get, you, they just basically all die in one go and it's just like a couple hundred or something just die in one go and you get all their heads. Uh, it's just an easy way of getting their heads, which sells for quite a lot of money. And um, yeah, you kind of have to get the hang of it. Like you have to know which is the perfect time to actually like properly hit them to actually be able to get them to properly time and stuff it, it, it's a bit confusing but it's it's pretty easy once you get the hang of it so yeah like once, once they've died you wait a couple seconds and then hit them just so they're like already low a bit but not low completely so yeah that one just died and then you punch it again and then it should drop another few stacks there beautiful and i've already got a full inventory of skeleton heads right there which sells for 124k so yeah pretty easy honestly just really easy ways of making money you don't have to make a melon farm it's a waste of time and you know obviously you can it's still it's still a way of making money especially at the start of the map but that is it that start of the map that's it especially at the moment i think there's only like a week or two left of this map you don't want to be wasting your time making melon farms and stuff you want to be you know getting yourself higher at the levels getting a skelly grinder and doing one of these or just fishing or just mining it, it's as simple as that guys but anyway guys that is going to be the end of the episode for today hopefully you did enjoy if you did enjoy this video please leave a like on it if you found it helpful if you found it enjoyable leave a like and also comment down below what you want to see next um people have been saying they want me to like remake my tutorial video which is like one of my most viewed videos on this channel so if you want me to remake it apparently psycho has changed a lot i'm gonna have to do a bit of research into it and i might make another tutorial video like an up-to-date one yeah, if you want to see that, comment down below and just let me know because I will. Uh, they're very enjoyable to make and I love making them. So I, I have no problem at all with making them. But uh, yeah, also just let me know what you want me to see in this series. If you want me to do more raids, I'm trying to find raids, but it's super, super hard to find them. But I'm still trying. Make sure you subscribe if you want to see my live streams. I'm live streaming quite a lot recently, like most nights I'm live streaming. So um, yeah, I might even be live streaming tonight, depending on when you see this. So um, yeah, leave a notification, uh, you know, tick the notification bell, subscribe to the channel, leave a like and all that jazz. And hope you enjoy this video, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.